Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft on our single player Let's Play world. We are here in the lovely realms of Minecraft. And I've been doing a bit of off-camera stuff. First of all, we have a bow in our inventory. And you might say, Silent, that's not special. You have an enchanted bow in your inventory. It can't be that good. Oh, it is, my friends. As you can see, we only have one arrow. Do you want to know what kind of bow this is? Power 4, Unbreaking 3, Flame, and Infinity. That's right, off an enchantment. We didn't even use the book that we got from the end. From the stronghold, not the end. We didn't even use the book that we got from the stronghold yet. So we still even have this other Infinity book right there, and this has Power 3. What we could even do is use that Power 3, upgrade it with that Power 4, get ourselves a Power 5, Unbreaking 3, Flame, and infinity bow that would be absolutely insane another little thing that I've worked on as you can see in the distance and right over here we have upgraded our little market stalls so they now have our updated market stall look if you want to know how to build this I did put a tutorial up on my channel a little while ago I don't know why I never did this sooner I just realized we need another one. Oh my goodness man I thought I was completely done with that I was wrong we have to go get some more white wool real quick, so I will be right back. All right, there we go, that's looking better. That's looking much better, but yeah, we have the upgraded market stall design up here. This shop is gonna be selling like bone meal and stuff like that, and then down here we upgraded all four of these, and I think it just looks much better. It's like a little upgrade, and I think it looks a ton better, adds a ton more detail down to this area. It just looks more crowded, which is what I wanted. I wanted a crowded little market stall area where people just kind of set up shop and they start selling their goods. So we've got this one selling like watermelons and pumpkins, this one selling eggs and bones, this one selling flint and gravel, all sorts of crazy things, seeds and carrots, all sorts of crazy cool things. But I really like this market stall design. Again, if you want to see the tutorial on how to make this, check out the old YouTube channel. There should be a playlist for this tutorial and whatnot. But yeah, in the tutorial, I forgot to add these stair or these uh, fences, I'm pretty sure. So you can add these fences if you want. It's totally optional. I think it looks better, but I forgot to do that in the, tor in the tutorial because I'm a derp. So yeah, anyways, let's continue back on up here. And what are we going to work on today? Well, we have a couple ender pearls. I've been trying to fight endermen all over the place. I've been trying to find them. I've been finding them, but they've not been dropping the ender pearls that I need. I think we needed like six more ender pearls or something. And I think so far we have about two. Let me double check here. We have kept yeah, two, two more ender pearls to our name. And then we also will probably need blaze powder again to get the Eye of Ender, so I think you know where this is headed, chat. Chat, psh, chat, my goodness. You are not Twitch chat? My gosh. I am so sorry, YouTube. You're not Twitch chat. I was streaming for like five hours yesterday, so I apologize for that. I get Twitch chat and YouTubes, YouTubes and all that. It's all the same thing. You're all the same, right? No. No, you're not all the same, but yeah. Anyways, I don't know what I'm saying right now. You're all great in your own ways, you YouTubes and Twitches. I don't even know. Anyways, I think today is going to be another nethery nether time. Oh boy, this, we're gonna have to go get blaze powder again. So let's see how this goes. Oh boy, there's a ghast already on the horizon, and there's glowstone here. Good thing we have an infinity bow. I don't want, I really don't want to lose this. That would be the worst thing ever. Oh, that's a, that's pits of death right there. Why are those there? All right, let's go. Let's try not to die. That would be awful. All right, here we go. Cross your fingers, chat. You don't want none of this. You don't want none of this. You don't want none of this. Take that. Did we already get the return to sender achievement? Whoops, that's not what I wanted to do. How much time have we spent in this world? 2.75 days spent in this world. That's crazy. 
Did we already get the return to sender achievement? Um, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I don't know where it is. We got local brewery into fire, build that. Yeah, no, did we get that taken? Yeah, we did get that. No, right? Yes, maybe. Okay, yeah, we haven't gotten the ones that the green goes to, so we've gotten all the other ones. We still need to brew a potion, locate the end. We have located it, but we haven't just gone in yet. We still need to cook a fish. We still need to travel by minecart at least one kilometer where, from where I start. Throw a diamond at another player. I don't know how I'm supposed to do that on a single player world. And eat a notch apple, which we have a notch apple. We just haven't eaten one yet. Kill a skeleton from more than 50 meters away. Fly a pig off a cliff and make a cake. We almost have all the achievements. Oh, oh man. And then we have these still. We need to get the end and then a beacon and then... Oh man, there's a lot more achievements actually than I thought. Alright, anyways, let's just continue on with what we were here to do in the first place. So let me get on over to that nether fortress and I will see you over there. Wow, that's a lot of lava. Wow, where... why is there all this lava here? What on earth, man? Look at this lava. I know I was gonna say... Like, what the heck? Why is there so much lava here? Baby zombie pigman, hi, how are you? Oh my gosh, look at all that lava. You scare me, guy. All right, I'm gonna head over to the fortress. I will see you there. Now that I think about it, I probably should have grabbed some blocks, but we have arrived at the fortress nonetheless. So that's good. Oh, of course. We got plenty of food. Let's just grab some of these nether blocks. Nether rack. Oh, look, this is a cool block. We need some more of this. This can be used as lava if you don't actually want to use lava. It can be used as a lava block instead of lava. It'll still hurt you if you step on it, but you won't, like, immediately get sucked in and die. So yeah, let's grab some of this. What is this called again? Magma blocks. Yeah, it's basically a lava block, but it's not lava. I hear lava. Alright, let me mine all this out real quick, and then we'll go up into the fortress. On second thought, there's a whole lot of this stuff. We can grab it when we need it. We have over a stack. Let's just head up into the fortress. I'm getting sidetracked. We'll grab some of it, but we don't need all of it right now because that's a huge magma block vein. Which is not a bad thing, but it's just we don't need it right now. All right, let's get up in this fortress and see if we can find some more blazes because finding the Enderman is easier than finding the blazes, it seems like. I mean, finding Enderman is not necessarily an easy thing to do, but I feel like finding blazes and getting their blaze rods is more, like, easy. More easy? More easy? Easier? Jeez, I can't even speak right now, man. Alright, let's go find ourselves a nice little blaze. I would like to find one just by itself. Let's have our bow out, actually. So that we don't die from all the death that is in the nethery netherness also oh there we go perfect if you can hear a difference in my audio quality that's because on obs i have made it there's a magma cube over there too all right get that out of here all right easy this is a dangerous game i'm playing all right good but that's because on obs i've made it so okay good got one of those got one of those oh jeez, man Stay away. Oh, give me that. Give me that. Give it to me. Give it. Give me. I've updated some things on OBS, added some filters to my audio so that it's less. there's less background noise and stuff, and I think that it sounds much better. But let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Does it sound good? Do you like how it sounds? Let me know. I want to know what you guys think. All right, cool, we got a magma cream and a blaze rod. This is already going fantastic. Let's see if we can't maybe find a wither skull as well. That would be cool. I've never actually found a wither skull on Minecraft before. Crazy, right? Craziness. I've never found one on a single player world. People have gotten them on multiplayer, but I've never found them on single player. There's so many over there. There's so many. Good thing we have an infinity bow. 
All right, let's go. Let's go, Blaze. Ooh, and there's a wither over there. There's a wither. Get wrecked. And oh, no, 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 no. Don't shoot the pigmen. Don't shoot the pigmen. There's another wither over there. There's another wither over there. If that wither shoots, or if that, if I get hit by that wither, or by any of these zombie pigmen that are just in the way, I'm done for. Done for, man. <gasps> oh, just like that. Just like that. No. 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 Bad. Get out of here. Oh, mm, no, my gosh. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it, you stupid, dumb, stupid blaze. Get out of here. Get out of my life. There's two of these blaze rods over here. Oh, get wrecked, you fool. Where did all these dudes come from? Oh, 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 we got a wither skull. We don't want to. We got a wither skull. Oh my gosh, our first ever wither skull. We got a flip flap and flip flap wither skull. We actually did it. I can't believe that. Oh my gosh, man. We got a wither skull. Okay, we have got to make it out of here safely, man. This is crazy. Easy. Jump down, run. Make sure nothing's chasing us. Good. Okay, let's get the heck out of here, man. We got what we need, but we don't have enough blaze rods yet. We have to continue for the blaze rods. Oh my goodness, man. We actually got a wither skull. My first ever wither skull on this world and just ever in any single player world ever. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of my life. Get out of my life. Uh huh. Get out of my life. Get out of my life. There we go. Almost level 30 again. Oh, what is this? That's nothing. Okay. What is up here? This what? Oh, why did I destroy that, man? Why did I destroy that? There were all those blazes back over there, so I mean, maybe there's another blaze spawner that way. Let's go investigate this here, a blaze, a spawner, shall we? Oh, oh, aha! Oh boy, oh boy. Ow, get burned, get burned, get burned. Get burned. Good thing we only need one arrow. That's real nice. That infinity is great. Run. Good. Nothing evil here. Do we get any more? No, I don't. Well, do we have four? Yeah, we did. We got another blaze rod. Awesome. So we probably need like two, three more. Hmm. There's got to be some around here somewhere, right? Come on now. Come on now, Minecraft. You're being good to me in the nether for once. This is such a surprise. I'm actually surviving in the nether. Like, this never happens. As you've seen from previous episodes, this never happens. But let's not let our guard down too easily. Because who knows what's lurking in these shadows of the nether. Anything over here? Nothing. There's our little fire arrow that tells us where the direction of home is. Okay, so we went this way. And then back down this way, right? Yeah, I think so. There's lava above us on the ceiling. What's up here? Where does this go? Nowhere. Okay, that's a dead end. Perfect. What about up there? There's nothing. Parkour our way across to over this way. Aha! Come on. Come on. Come on. Good thing fire doesn't affect you. Or good thing I have an infinity bow. It's not a good thing that fire doesn't affect you, but, well... I guess it's a good thing for you that fire doesn't affect you, right? I guess. I don't know, man. Uh, where do these guys keep spawning from? Like, up here? Like, how do they just keep spawning? There's no... Do these guys just spawn on their own occasionally now? Like, what's the deal with that? I don't know, man. I don't know anything about this game anymore. But yeah, hmm. Let me see if I can find a couple more blazes and then I will meet you guys when we've successfully either made it out of the nether. Wow, I said successfully really weird. I slurred that word real bad. 
happy. Let's see if I can make it out of the nether successfully or if I die in the process. So I will be right back on one of those two options. We have actually done it. We have actually survived the nether with all of our loot. We got a bunch of magma blocks that we are going to shove right on in this chest right here. We got six blaze rods, which now that I think about it, we didn't need six blaze rods because these each three makes blaze powder and that's going to make the eye vendor right. Let me double check that real quick. It's not with these. No, it's with the blaze powder. So we only needed, oh, they only make two. Oh, I thought they made three each, but they only make two. So we need six like that and that. So far we have two eyes of ender. Oh no. This whole chest is just full of eggs, by the way, in case anyone was wondering. We got a Wither Skeleton Skull. That is the huge achievement for today. We got a Wither Skull. We did it. That's my first ever Wither Skull in this world. That's my first ever Wither Skull in Minecraft single player. So that, that's an achievement all in itself. That's our own personal achievement right there. Put that quartz there, that netherrack there. We lost our water bucket because I accidentally used it in the nether and I forgot that that doesn't work. But that's no big deal. We will just grab this water right over here. And then we will go back over to the potion wizard tower thingy. And then we'll drop this stuff off in this chest right over here. Perfect. I don't know why an egg's over there. But now that we have this, maybe we should make some potions. Do you think? What potions would be good for an ender dragon fight? I don't know. Let me know down in the comments what potions I should make, if any potions, for the ender dragon fight. Because I think the ender dragon fight is looming on the horizon, my friends. I think that it is going to be very soon. Very, very soon. I just need to get those dang endermen to drop their ender pearls until we have enough. I need to double check and make sure how many we need exactly, but I'm sure we'll have enough with all the blaze powder that we got. We should be fine. So yeah, the ender dragon fight should be on the horizon. I've never fought the ender dragon in single player either, so give me some tips. Let me know what I should know, what I should bring, what I should gear up with. I know I need to have full diamond armor. Oh, also, let me go head back to my storage room real quick. I enchanted some diamond armor, and I'm completely out of diamonds now, so I definitely need to go do some diamond mining, but... I got my full set, almost, of diamond armor, and I'm going to show you the enchantments on it. All we need now is a pair of pants. We have a boots that are good, we got a nice chest piece, and we have a nice helmet. Let's go see over here real quick. I just need pants, so we just need a few more diamonds, and I wish we had fortune on this pickaxe, but it was only unbreaking because it's a garbage tier pickaxe. Where's my diamond armor? Oh, that's right, I moved it. Gosh dang, silly me, I forgot that I moved it over here to the blacksmith shop. That's right. I totally forgot about that because it makes sense having the iron armor, or not iron armor, but just any armor sets on the blacksmith shop because that's what a blacksmith does. They create armor and weapons for people. So that's where we've kept it. We put it on an armor stand right over here. We got those chain boots there, and we have this diamond armor right here. Grab this, grab that, and grab those boots right there. And the enchantments are Protection 3, Unbreaking 3, Protection 4, No Unbreaking, Unbreaking 3, Protection 3. So it's not the best in the world, but we can maybe enchant some books, get that up there with a little bit more enchanting. I mean, we do have 30 levels, so do we want to enchant a book? We might as well try, right? We don't have enough diamonds to go make our pair of pants, so we can't enchant those. But we might as well enchant a book, see what we can get. We got 30 levels, and I, don't, I mean, we could die, and we might lose them, so... Might as well use them while we got them. Use them till you lose them, I guess. Alright. We have a bunch of books right here, which is fantastic. And we need three Lupus Lapis Lapis. All right, cool beans, cool beans. Let's put three there. And let me see what we got going on here. No chicken from that egg. That's fine with me. That is a-okay with me. Let me see what we can get from this enchantment. I need all of your enthusiasm. 
What are we going to get from this enchantment? Give me good luck, YouTubers. 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 It's so weird, because, like, I call... Oh, jeez, really? Bane of arthropods? Are you kidding me right now? Ah, it's not even worth it. It's just... Wait, what are the other two enchantments? Unbreaking one, project... Oh, gah. Oh, nope. No book enchantment today, but we'll leave that there. Just in case we want to do some enchanting. But yeah, YouTubers... Twitchers, I don't know what you'd call Twitch people, YouTube, Twitch, whatever. I didn't have the good lucks with the book, but yeah. I've been trying to upload at least two videos a day now, and I streamed yesterday for about five hours. I've been trying to put in a lot more work into making YouTube content and streams and stuff like that. I just want to put more work into it and make it like worth it. I want my content on YouTube to be worthwhile watching. I don't just want to put up some garbage video and say, hey, you should watch this because I made it. I want it to be worth your time watching. Like, you come to my channel because you enjoy my content, so I mean, I should at least put, like, good time and work into making a good video so you guys will enjoy it, you know? I don't know. I just feel like lately with the Minecraft stuff, at least this series, I felt like it was getting a little bit lackluster. And I just needed to put a little bit more effort into it. Actually, I need to put a lot more effort into it. But yeah, let me know what you guys' thoughts are on this series. What I could change about it, what you think would be good to see new. Also, one more thing before we end off this episode here. Do you think we need a change in scenery? Do you think that this town needs a break? Do you think we need to start on a new town after the Ender Dragon fight? I think it would only be fitting that if after the Ender Dragon fight we go off, explore a new area, start a new town, and then eventually work our way back here, make a little path connecting over to here, make another town. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think of those ideas down in the comments below. I want to get your feedback. I want to get some comments, and I want to respond to you because I love responding to your guys' comments. I try to respond to as many comments as possible because I really enjoy doing it. Also, we need to continue this path up to the door here like this like so there we go that's looking good right there perfect awesome alrighty friends well I think that is all the time we have for this episode today I want to thank you all so much for watching and supporting the channel I really really appreciate it it means the world to me that you guys come out just watch a video and like that you're just generally like all of you are great people like I don't know man it's just, it's great to have a nice community like we have here. Obviously the best community on Twitch and on YouTube combined. You guys are just great and I love all of your faces. Thank you for supporting the dream. That is so kind of you and I can't thank you enough for that. But yes, friends, that is it for this episode. I want to thank you all for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you've enjoyed and are new to the channel. But yeah, as always, my name is Silent Scale. I will see you all next time.